Well, I went down to the bookstore just the other day. I went to buy a Bible for I had just got saved. When I asked to see a Bible, I could not understand. They had a shelf full, ten feet long, each one a different brand. They had the ASV and the RSV, good news for modern men. They seem to have a version for every cult and clan. The so-called living Bible and the brand new NIV. But I soon found out the devil was the one who started these. So I took an ASV to church, the preacher preached in Psalms. When he started reading, I knew something was wrong. I wondered if he could not breathe, or was he going blind? But I finally figured out he had a different kind. Was it a Mormon Bible, or some book from some religious sect? Or the new Schofields then stay departed from the King James text? Or the so-called Living Bible? Or good news for modern man? But I soon found out that all of this was part of Satan's plan. So I went back down to the bookstore to get my money back. But when I told them all my problems, they just slapped me on the back. And said, well, my son, some of these Bibles are hard to understand. I suggest that you should try good news for a modern man. So I took the other version. I thought I'd give it a try. But when I showed it to my pastor, he said it was a lie. They attacked the blood of Jesus, saying he was not God on earth. They even put some cuss words in and denied the virgin birth. Wicked! So if you go to buy a Bible, please take this good advice. Take nothing but the old King James, the others may sound nice. Compared to the new translations, old King James may seem odd, but the difference is expected when you have the Word of God.